The Tokyo Paralympic Games went really well. It was just so great to be out competing again, you know, after Corona and everything. Um, and I feel so proud to have won two silver medals for my country. And it was, it was just a great event. It feels amazing to be able to represent Coventry. It's where I was born, where I've trained throughout my whole athletics career and now where I study. So I'm just really proud of the city and it's just great that the city's able to showcase itself as a place for sport and culture. So when I started at Warwick, I was a sports scholar and I've been a sports scholar for the past three years. So being a sports scholar means that I have support in terms of SNC, which I've been able to use while I've been here, in terms of being able to use the gym, the swimming pool, and just all those great facilities. And honestly, just to have it so close, to have it on campus, and to have such quick and easy access um, has been really useful. It feels amazing to be able to celebrate here at Warwick. It's been a while since the games, but it's really great and I feel really thankful that they've continued you know, to support me and to do this event. When I got back from Tokyo, I celebrated with chocolate cake. Um, I do like chocolate cake, but actually, funnily enough, straight after my um, last event at the Paralympic Games, 800 meters, we literally ate chocolate cake straight away. Literally, I think I probably ate chocolate cake before I warmed down. My next goal is to represent Team England at the Commonwealth Games, so I'm really excited about that. That'll be the first time that I've represented England. And to have it in the West Midlands as well will be so amazing, to have that home games experience. I think the one piece of advice I'd give people in terms of sport and actually in terms of even academia is just to be patient and really to enjoy the process of what you do, if, that, if that's training, if that's studying. And I think that's really helped me to just make the most of you know, my journey so far.